8 mm external diameter and 2.5 mm thick to stop. Take length of the column as 2.3 meter and hinge right at both ends to stop. Take modulus of elasticity E is equal to 205 GPA to stop. Also determine the crippling load by ranking formula using constant as 335 MPA and 1 by 7500. Okay. So first of all, write down the given data. External diameter it is given. External. External diameter that is capital D is equal to capital D is equal to 38 mm. 38 mm. Then thickness of cube T it is given. T is equal to 2.5 mm. 2.5 mm. Then calculate internal diameter small d is equal to capital D minus minus 2t minus 2t okay so I will explain why it is 2t here this is circular hello circular tube it is hello circular tube so internal diameter it is this one it is internal diameter okay and this one it is thickness of tube. This distance it is thickness of tube. This one it is thickness of tube T. Okay, T. And external diameter it is capital D. This one. This one it is capital D. So capital D is equal to. So this one it is capital D. Small D. We need to calculate to calculate small D. Small D is equal to capital D minus two thickness. This thickness and this thickness. So it will get small d. Okay. No, small d is equal to capital D it is 38 mm, 38 mm minus 2 into 2 into t it is 2.5 mm, 2.5. It will be get small d is equal to small d is equal to 33 mm. Small d is equal to 33 mm. Then end condition it is even. End condition. End condition. Both ends are hinged. It's hinged. Both ends hinged. Both ends hinged. Both ends hinged. Both ends hinged. Hinged. So L is equal to for that. L is equal to L. L is equal to L. So L it is given 2.3 meter. Convert it is in mm 2300 mm okay then e models of elasticity it is given e is equal to 205 205 gp okay so gp gp convert it is in newton mm 20 205 into 10 to the power 3 10 to the power 3 Newton per mm square, 10 to the power 3 Newton per mm square. Okay. Newton per mm square. So now find out moment of inertia. I is equal to I is equal to I is equal to pi into small d raised to 4. Sorry, capital D raised to 4. Minus small d raised to 4, 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 divided by 64, divided by 64, divided by 64, 64. So we get solve this value here is equal to small d into. Capital D it is 38 mm, 38 rest 4, 38 rest 4, then minus small d it is 33, 33 rest 4, 33 rest 4 divided by 64, divided by 64, divided by 64, divided by 64. Divided by 64. Divided by 64. So we get i is equal to moment of inertia is equal to so pi into 38 raised to 4 minus 33 raised to 4 divided by 64 
it will be 44. 44.140 into 10 to the power 3. 10 to the power 3. Mm raised to 4. Mm raised to 4. So I will note down this value. 44.140 i is equal to 44.140 into 10 raised to 3 mm square. Okay. Then Euler's Euler's crippling load. Euler's Euler's crippling load. Euler's crippling load is equal to is equal to that is Euler's crippling load is equal to pi square pi square square e i pi square pi square e i divided by l e square divided by l e square divided by l e square l e square I squared divided by L e square. Put all this value here. Is equal to pi square pi square into into it is two zero five into ten raised to the power three into I it is moment of energy it is one forty four. Sorry, 44.140 into 10 raised to the power 3 divided by L e square. Divided by L e square. L e square. It is 2300 square. 2300 square. Did we get? Euler's crippling load that is P E is equal to P e is equal to pi square into two zero five into ten to the power three to forty four point one four zero into ten to the power three divided by two three zero zero square. That will be sixteen point eight eight sixteen point eight eight into ten to the power Newton. Newton. Right on. Euler's crippling load is equal to 16.88 kilo newton. 16.88 kilo newton. Okay. So then ranking crippling load or ranking crippling load calculate. Second question it is ranking, ranking crippling load. Ranking skipping load. For that, for that, we need cross sectional area. Cross sectional area is equal to for hello to pi into capital D square. Capital D square. Capital D square. Minus small d square. Minus small d square. Small d square, d square minus small d square divided by 4, divided by 4, divided by 4 is equal to, is equal to pi into capital D square, it is 38 square, 38 square. Square. Okay, square. Then minus thirty three square. Thirty three square internal diameter is thirty three. Thirty three bracket close divided by divided by four divided by four. So we get A is equal to shift into 
38 square minus 33 square divided by 4. So it will be 278.816, 278.816 mm square, mm square. So ranking scribbling load, so ranking scribbling load, ranking scribbling load, ranking Ranking scribbling load. Scribbling load. Load is equal to sigma CS. Sigma CS into A into A divided by divided by divided by one plus one plus a one plus a in bracket L E in bracket L E L E by K it is radius of gyration. It is radius of gyration. Back it close. Back it close. Into square. Into square. That list radius of gyration. List that is radius of gyration. List radius of gyration. That is small k small k is equal to small k is equal to small k is equal to root of i by a. this one it is root of i by a. this one it is i by i by a i by a. This root okay. I by okay. is equal to so moment of inertia is 44.140 into 10 to the power 3 divided by divided by area it is 278.8 278.81 mm. This one it is root of. All this value it is in root of. We get k value from this. We get k value from this. k is equal to 44.140 into 10 to the power 3 divided by answer. 44.146 to 10 power of by 270.81 root of answer. It will be 12.58 mm. 12.58 mm. Put all this value here now in ranking scribbling load formula. Ranking scribbling load formula. So is equal to sigma CS it is 335 MPA. Cross sectional area of beam it is 278.81 divided by divided by divided by divided by 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 8 is 1 by 8 is 1 by 7500 1 by 7500 then in bracket in bracket in bracket L, le it is 2300 2300 and k it is 12.5 k it is 12.5 k it is 12.5 k it is 12.5 
సో దిస్ వన్ ఇట్ ఇస్ బ్రాకెట్ స్క్వేర్ బ్రాకెట్ స్క్వేర్ బ్రాకెట్ స్క్వేర్ విల్ గెట్ ర్యాంకింగ్ స్క్రిప్లింగ్ లోడ్ ఆర్ ఫిజికల్ టు ర్యాంకింగ్ స్క్రిప్లింగ్ లోడ్ త్రీ త్రీ ఫైవ్ జీరో ఇన్ టూ టూ సెవెంటీ ఎయిట్ పాయింట్ ఎయిట్ వన్ ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ సాల్వ్ దిస్ వన్ టూ త్రీ జీరో జీరో డివైడ్ బై ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ సో దిస్ వన్ ఇట్ ఈస్ యాక్చువల్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ సో టూ త్రీ జీరో జీరో డివైడ్ బై ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిట్ స్క్వేర్ then into 1 by 7500 plus 1 and 3350 into 278 278.81 divided by answer it will be it will be get rankings loads 17.17.17 1 1 6 into 10 to the power 3 10 to the power 3 newton newton so ranking scribbling load it will be equal to kilo newton 17.116 kilo newton kilo so this one it is illustrate ranking scribbling load for given data